Once Upon a Deadpool is now in theaters and is Deadpool 2, no longer R, PG-13, and also told from the perspective of Deadpool, telling the kid, well, who's now an adult, from A Princess Bride. And I'll be honest, this is a hard film to review. Not that it was like game-changing or so bad it was good, but because it's a film that I've already reviewed Deadpool 2. You can find it on my channel. And I thought it was solid. For the genre it was, for what it was going to be, it was solid. But this film, all that's been changed is that there's no blood, F-words that are bleeped, and occasionally you'll see Deadpool talking with the kid that was in A Princess Bride who's now an adult. That's it. Those are the only changes. So I can't really even say, yeah, the story was good, or yeah, the acting was good, or anything, because I've reviewed this film already just when it was in its original form, R-rated. This is a cash grab, first and foremost. It is a cash grab to see if Deadpool can be in Marvel PG-13 movies. It's really a test. You know, there's a reason why it's only in 500 theaters. Um, it's a test to see if they can do this because they're not, they're not spending that much money. Most like most of this footage you've already seen Deadpool 2 and the little bit of footage that is new, it, it didn't cost that much. I'd say probably a couple million, and a couple million is what it's gonna make at the first weekend at the very least. So it's really just a test. And it's again Marvel doing what they love doing, making money, which don't get me wrong, I get it. It's a film industry, it's a business. But I just don't like the unnecessary cash grabs. And this film felt unnecessary. And I'll be honest. It made me like Deadpool 2 even less because it reminded me of all the flaws of it. You know, when I think of Deadpool 2, like if someone brings up Deadpool 2, I think of Cable, you know, or I think of the X-Force scene and that like chase that ensued, you know, like those are scenes I liked. But watching this film, it just reminded me again of the scene, the scenes I, and the stuff I didn't like in the movie, just watered down to PG-13 format. So it just... It was honestly a tough film to watch because I I just felt like it was so unnecessary and not really entertaining either. And again, it just lessens the impact of Deadpool 2 for me. And it's really just a short to the point review. If you liked Deadpool 2 and you want to kind of revisit it just in the type of form where you can watch it with like a young teenager, 13, 14 or even younger, then this is the film to watch. You know, obviously, it's just, it's like a recut, a re-edit. It's like when the King's Speech came out and they re-edited it to PG-13. It's literally just like that. So, once upon a time, Deadpool, honestly, for me personally, I'm being nice here. And uh, I'll be giving a two and a half out of five star rating, which I'm saying this now. Probably a month or two from now when I think of this movie, I'll probably give it a two out of five. But for now, you know what? I'll give it a two and a half out of five. I'll be nice you know, I'll be nice. But again, considering I gave Deadpool 2 a 3.5 and a 5, this just this film just made me like that movie even less. So take that for what it is. But anyways, once upon a Deadpool. Did you guys like it? Did you guys not like it? Let me know your thoughts. Is it a cash grab? Is it a non-cash grab? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I'm very curious to hear them. And as always, don't forget subscription, notification bell, and I'll catch you guys.